This cave is a perfect hiding place. I don't think he'll find us here. Did you see Saul's army? He must have 3,000 men looking for you by now. King Saul is jealous of you, David. He'll stop at nothing to get rid of you once and for all. He's right. Ever since you killed Goliath and God promised to make you king of Israel, you've been a marked man. God will protect us. We've been on the run for a long time, but he's taken care of us so far, hasn't he? I think I hear him. Hurry, to the back of the cave. Take a break, men. I'm going to rest in here for a minute or two. Whew. It's much cooler in this cave. Curse that, David. Every time I've closed in on him, he slips away. Not this time, though. I'm hot on his trail. He's nearby. I can just feel it. What is it about that, David? Why does God honor him over me? Why does everyone think he's so special? I could have killed Goliath if I wanted to, but I'm the king. I'm the one in charge. <sighs> one thing at a time. Right now, I'll take a short break. But then, that David's a goner for sure. Hmm. Can you believe it? King Saul, right here in front of us. Now's your chance, David. Jump on him. Come on, David, let him have it. <laughs> you came that close to the enemy and you let him go? David, if you killed him when you had the chance, you wouldn't have to run anymore. I can't believe I cut his robe. I shouldn't have done that to a king chosen by God. It was disrespectful and wrong. Mm. Oh, well, that short map was all I needed. Time to finish what I came for. Saddle up, men. We've been chasing David long enough. Today's the day I capture him. My king. David? Why do you listen to people who say I'm trying to harm you? You can see with your own eyes it isn't true. Think about it. God gave me the chance to take your life just a few minutes ago. Even though my own men want me to kill you, I would never hurt you. Look, here's a piece from your robe. I cut it off to show you how close I was. But I didn't kill you because I respect you as my king. I'm not an evil man, so I can't do an evil deed. God will judge you, not me. You're a better man than I am, David. You showed me kindness and respect when you could have killed me. I can tell God's on your side. You'll become the new king of Israel. Men, about face, we're going home. Whoa. I can't believe I saw that with my own eyes. That was amazing, David. You got yourself out of a big mess and nobody even got hurt. I only followed God's rule. What's that? Simple. God tells us to respect people in charge, no matter who they are. I'm glad I did. <laughs>